this one. So let's try. Is there a sound that makes it when it's recording? What's up guys, welcome to Supercars of London and another daily vlog. I am just heading to SB. So yesterday I had a day out of the office and in meetings, meaning that today is gonna be spent in the office doing emails, but the main point, the main point of today is that I'm gonna be transitioning between the iPhone and my new Canon, not Sony, Canon vlogging camera. So. I've brought it with me, it's in my bag, and today I'm gonna to be showing you some of the challenges that I'm probably gonna be facing when I'm using this camera as opposed to this, um, but also some of the benefits as well of using that camera in London, out of London, but just vlogging in general. First few minutes in the office. Bet this isn't open. Just realized that I may have put the SB password in the vlog. This is my usual morning routine if I'm in the office. And I've just realized that, get the aircon on, I forgot to uh, throw this away. Is there any sort of package? Doesn't look like there's a package yet, which is frustrating. I need my Montar car mount. Proposal is finished, and there's a Ferrari 348 outside. It does sound good though. Proper original Ferrari sound. Not sure whether you can hear that from all the way up here, um, but all of my videos from yesterday have been transferred to my laptop, so now it is going to be to the editing suite, which is the same as my office, which is the same as the bar. Um, I wanna get this video edited and uh, online so that then I can start playing around and exploring the Canon S120. The final bit is uh, getting done, as you can see here. Corel Video Studio, the most basic video editing software, but because it's the most basic, it's the easiest to bash these videos out. So the time has come. Unfortunately, I do not have a case. This is my new vlogging camera. It's the Canon S120. I always called it the Sony S120 because I'm used to having my Sony Handycam that isn't with me at the moment. And then as you can see up here, we have the on off switch and we've got all of the different settings there, the zoom here. Um, and it's a power shot, compact camera. And I um, completely bypassed the fact that it could actually take pictures. Um, <laughs> I just bought this as a vlog vlogging camera and know that the lens is very good with um, all of the cool bits and pieces. So I'm gonna turn it on so you guys get to see the, the look. It's automatically on. It's on video mode. Give it a try or run by pressing on. Will that record? On and off button does not record. <laughs> right, so it must be this one. So let's try. Is there a sound that makes it when it's recording? Are we recording? Can't tell. whether that was recording or not. Aha, it did record. How do you play it though? Did it take a video? Um, see, this is why, ladies and gentlemen, I am doing a trial run. So what I did here, rather than press the record button, which you can see here, all I did was, I really apologize for the glare. If you look at this, I managed to take a photo even though it's in video mode. So maybe if I press this, take it out of playback mode, press this one, there we go. We are recording, this is the first time that I've used this camera and I wonder how good it is. 
don't know whether I can, hopefully this comes out well. So, some of the difficulties that I'm going to be facing. Number one is the fact that there is no screen. I'm just looking at the lens. Does it work? I don't know. I can see myself, which means, and it says recording here, so it must be working. So, let me know what you think. This is the new, oh, that is the Royal Mail, Royal Mail van. I wonder whether my Montar car mount has arrived. Let's go down and check with this camera rather than you guys. I can, hopefully this comes out well. So, some of the difficulties that I'm gonna be facing, number one is the fact that there is no screen. I'm just looking at the lens. Does it work? I don't know. I can see myself, which means, and it says recording here, so it must be working. So, let me know what you think. This is the new, oh, that is the Royal Mail, Royal Mail van. I wonder whether my Montar car mount has arrived. So let me know what you thought of my first test. Obviously it wasn't that good. I'm gonna go downstairs and do it with a car. I will talk you through some of the problems that I'm gonna face with this camera as I'm getting used to it. Obviously the one that I remember uh, said first is there is no screen here. As I'm looking at the screen now just to see what I'm doing, I need to be looking at this guy, which is the lens, and it means I'm looking down the camera. So what I'm gonna to have to get used to is not actually seeing a screen at all and just looking down this baby. Now, the other thing that I've been told is a real problem on this camera is if you're walking around like this or holding it normally, how you would, the microphones are at the top here, as you can see there, I'm pointing, right? Um, so if you're walking around like this, and you're holding it as comfortably as possible, you might accidentally cover the microphone. So it's not the best placement in terms of handling it, which is why the um, Canon has put this little thumb thing here. So basically the idea is you hold it. Hold on, let me turn it on. You hold it like this. So you press the record button and it starts to record. And you basically, try not to go anywhere near the microphone. So you have to record like this, and then you can hear everything. And this is probably looking really weird on this one, um, but I'm just trying to get to grips. We're talking to the lens here, and what you're seeing now, as I'm swapping between the two uh, different formats, is a little bit of behind the scenes of behind the scenes, because these daily vlogs is giving you an, up, uh, an idea of what it's like behind the scenes, and currently, I'm having a very boring day in the office. It is very hot and yeah, I know I'm wearing all black and a black hoodie and it's 24 degrees outside. Uh, but I'm headed to JHD Barber's to get my hair cut. It doesn't look like there's any space unless he's going. In which case, oh, it's a disabled spot, I can't go there. Let's slip this car in reverse and get a move on back home. Quickly pick up some bits and bobs. And then it's finally back to SB for the final part of the day. Now, two of the guys from SB are at Spa at the moment. Highly jealous of them, never been there, but it looks awesome with the Ferrari. Um, so I'm gonna try and, tr try and get some pictures as and when that happens because um, I think it'd be pretty cool. A quick trip home and I thought that I'd introduce you to this new wall that I have behind me that I'm probably gonna start using more in my vlogs when I'm vlogging at home, editing videos or whatever. I'm gonna try and convert this room into a bit of a video studio um, until I move out and get my own one big studio place because basically that's the only reason why I'd move out um, to have a bed and a studio. <laughs> um, but anyway, um, I'm just gonna be five minutes or so then heading back to SB. Now, because I'm so close to the wall, I'm literally get across like this and head off. 
for the weekend because I'm heading into London tomorrow. <sighs> heading home now and testing the camera out to see whether it works in the car just by holding it for now until my car man arrives. I'm excited about heading into London tomorrow. What a beautiful evening. Oh, is that right there? Damn it, I think you may have missed that. Silver R8. Big lorry. But there's also a GTR driving around here, but I can't seem to find it. I'm also trying to get used to the uh, where the record button is on this so I can stop it without looking. So tomorrow, the camera gets tested fully in London for its first time, and I'm looking forward to testing out the battery, the sound quality, but also the the camera quality and the focus as well which uh, is a main point of this style of camera which I'm really excited about but ladies and gentlemen that is the end of my working day today and tomorrow heading into central London I need to be clever with what I wear because it's warm at the moment 24 degrees but thank you for watching guys and I hope you've enjoyed this and hope and the transition between my iPhone and this camera and from now on it's gonna be all on this camera so Make sure that you subscribe, and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. I just had an edge there on my shoulder, but see you tomorrow, guys. Holy crap. I was not expecting that car to drive. <laughs>